I just want to show you how easy it is to make pasta. Oh, there you go. Uh, and then pop the eggs into their little well and do it and then gradually bring it in from the side. Right, can you see how it's sticking together? See, you've got a few crumbs in there. Yeah, that's looking good. Right, just squeeze all them crumbs together. Right, that's good. Now, and now squeeze it now, bring it to a ball. Right, so turn it out onto the deck. So, you see what I mean by some crumbs? Some of you, you know, have got mucky fingers. <laughs> <laughs> right, looking good in right. the cling full. Over to your pasta and just roughly wrap it up like that. I'm going to stick it over here. You roll it like that. Now really push it like that so it looks like you, you love saffron. I've rolled it here, I've passed it to a machine on number one. Then fold it into thirds now. So there's a third that side roughly, yeah? Then apply, apply some pressure along the front of that oblong like that and then start rolling. On number two, go like that and leave a couple of inches overlap here. Bring this over the top and put your hand in there. Go to number three or number four and then just don't pull it, just gather the slack. Now once you've got it like that then, okay, I've gone through, so that's about number five, okay. You take that then now, okay. Put some cling film over the top, but never let them touch, because they could stick, and never put it in the fridge. Don't put it in the fridge, because again, it can stick in the fridge. You hand in once you're halfway through, and bring it up, and then, you can hang it on a couple of spoons or a rolling pin. You take or a little bit of semolina and turn it like that, and that'll stop it from sticking together. And you can let it air, you can let it dry like that for a couple of hours, or you can hang it, which is faster.